What's up? Danny High Soccer with Call Inc. helping people do their business better. And today we're going to take a look at the Logitech Brio, the Cisco WebEx desk camera, and the Yealink UVC30 desk camera. All right, and the reason we're looking at these is because they're all very comparably priced. They all have the ability to provide 4K video resolution, and they all have adjustable field of views, and they all support Windows Hello uh, facial authentication. So let's just get into it, right? The Logitech Brio comes in at 199 WebEx desk camera, and you can get it for 199. The Yealink UVC30 desktop, $189. Price-wise, they're all very comparably priced. In terms of system requirements, all of them uh, require Windows 7, Windows 10, uh, Mac OS 10.10, .10, uh, or higher. All these cameras are compatible and or certified for Skype for Business, Microsoft Teams, Cisco WebEx, Zoom, and, and others. The Logitech comes in with a three-year limited hardware warranty. The Cisco WebEx desk camera comes with a one-year limited liability warranty, and the Yealink UVC30 desktop camera comes in with a two-year limited hardware warranty, resolution and frames per second. For the Logitech Brio 4K Ultra HD, 30 or 60 frames per second, Cisco WebEx desk camera, you have up to 4K at 30 frames per second. The Yealink UVC30 desktop camera has 4K at 30 frames per second. Field of view, this is where it gets a little bit interesting and you guys, are, I'm gonna show you this. Field of view for the Logitech Brio can be adjusted from 65, 78, and 90 degrees. The Cisco WebEx desk camera has of adjustment from 65, 70, 75 and 81 and the UVC 30 desktop camera 70 90 and 120 degree field of view they all have autofocus uh, auto framing they all have built-in microphones uh, the Logitech Brio has two omnidirectional mics the Cisco WebEx desk camera has two and the UVC 30 desktop simply says yes there's a built-in microphone Logitech Brio has USB A plug and play and it does support USB C the Cisco WebEx desk camera includes both a USB-C to A and a USB-C to C cable. And what's interesting is that the Logitech and the Cisco webcams both have a cable that you can detach from the actual camera. Yaley cable is hardwired in. Privacy shutters, in terms of privacy shutters, uh, the one on the Yealink attaches, so it physically attaches and it shuts down just like that. The Logitech Brio, same thing, you attach this, this little guy comes off, and, you know, you put it on. Cisco, which I prefer in terms of privacy shutters, I always like it when they're built in as opposed to having to attach or clamp it on somehow. This guy is built in. So the cable length of the Logitech Brio is 7.2 feet, Cisco WebEx 4.92 feet, Yealink 5.25 feet. You know, like this has the ability to attach to a tripod. This guy here on the Logitech Brio, if you haven't seen it, some of the other videos, this actually, you have to remove this from the stand and it does like pop off so that pops off and then that's how you can mount that um, and then on the Cisco it's built right there like most let's just plug these guys in and of course they all have software uh, it's all different um, I know like for the Logitech Brio I was able to use uh, not only Logitune but I was also able to use uh, the Logitech Capture uh, to where you can make some of the adjustments for Yealink you have Yealink USB Connect software to make any adjustments. In Cisco, I forget what it's called. Un momento, por favor. It's just simply called uh, Cisco WebEx Test Camera uh, app. It's on my, uh, it's just the desktop app. But anyway, let's just uh, plug them in and let's get to testing them side by side. And we'll also test the mics that are built in. All right, stay tuned. All right, so first up, we have the Logitech Brio. Uh, here is the video resolution quality and it's not at 4k so right now the setting for this particular uh filming is at uh, 1080p or should be at 1080p and what i'm going to do is i'm going to go ahead and turn off uh, all the lights all right there's some light coming in uh from my blinds over there on my window uh, but other than that, anyway, all right, so what I'm trying to show you here in this video is that through Logitech Capture software, this is where you would be able to adjust the field of view. So right now, in this 
top right uh, screen, uh, you have the field of view at 90 degrees. And so we're going to go ahead and adjust that to 78 degrees. So I'm going to click that. And so there's 78 degree field of view. And I'm going to adjust it now to 65. And there is 65 degree field of view. So you can see you can use this to adjust depending on your environment, right? So if you're in an environment that you don't necessarily want to show, you can reduce that field of view uh, through Logitech Capture. Um, and again, it's absolutely free. Uh, and again, you can see you can go 65, 78, or 90 degrees. So now we're going to hop on to uh, the other cameras to show you where to or where you can go to adjust the, uh, the field of view. All right, so now we have the Cisco uh, WebEx desk camera uh, plugged in, and um, there it is. This is, I don't know what the slow, I don't know if you guys are seeing slow motion, but I'm seeing like slow motion uh, from, from my end, but it ha I, don't, I don't think it has anything to do with the camera. It has to do with my dying uh, laptop over here. I think it's just used and abused. But anyway, I'm utilizing the built-in microphones of the Cisco WebEx desk camera, and I'm going to go ahead and turn off the... Uh, the lights. All right, so here we are. Uh, again, all the lights are out except for the light that's coming in kind of through the blinds of my window, uh, but it's completely uh, dark in this room. Uh, and this is the Cisco WebEx desk camera. All right, so now here we have Cisco WebEx desk camera uh, app here and here's where you would go to adjust the field of view for the Cisco WebEx desk camera and so you have multiple options the Logitech Brio and the Yealink UVC 30 uh, give you three uh, different options where the uh, Cisco WebEx desk camera gives you uh, four different options so with the Cisco WebEx desk camera you have the option of 81 degrees which is what this is right now and I'm going to switch it over to 75 all right, so that's 75, and then I'm going to switch it down to 70. And so you see it's starting to, to reduce the, the field of view there, and I'm going to switch it over to 65 now. And so here's 65. So these features are really great to have um, because it gives you more flexibility with a single camera. I just wanted to, to show you that here. All right. All right. So now we're back. I've been spending my time uh, updating uh, software and firmware for each of these uh, cameras. And so now we have the UVC 30 desktop uh, by Yealink. And right now I have it set at 120 degree field of view and I'm utilizing the built in uh, microphones. Uh, another thing that I wanted to talk about was the packaging. So these these uh, brands and these models are designed for mass deployment. And so if you look at the boxes, they're just kind of plain brown boxes uh, designed to easily uh, deploy uh, throughout an organization and to have them shipped. Um, and let me just turn off some lights. <coughs> Hold on. All right, so again, all the lights are out. Um, and, and this is important because uh, regardless of the work environment, uh, they, they, they all may be different, uh, especially if people are working remotely. Uh, some locations uh, don't have the best lighting or, or they have really poor lighting or they have bad lighting, meaning they have like a window directly behind them that's uh, on uh, or, or open and, and you know flashing or not flashing but beaming in a light from outside uh, through their back. Uh, so it's really important to get cameras that can adjust to whatever the lighting uh, environment is uh, in any particular uh, location. All right, so now we have the Yealink UVC30 camera right here. And then I have the Cisco cameras filming this little section down here for whatever reason. Anyway, so I have been trying to adjust the field of view for this, um, but uh, apparently I need to do something else, maybe I need an update or something. But uh, when it, and it does work because I've, I've done it. So I don't know what's happening at this particular moment in time, uh, but you just go here to the Yealink Ye USB Connect software. Again, it's absolutely free. We'll include links uh, to all the software in the description box below. Uh, but you come here to advanced settings and you will see right here, you got field of view and you have the option here to 
adjust from 120 to 90 degrees uh, to 70 degrees. Uh, but again, I've been attempting to do that and it just keeps defaulting back to 120 for some reason. Um, I believe I have a video of that somewhere, but if not, we'll get this to work and I'll do a whole other video showing this uh, feature here. But yes, you, you can adjust the field of view here. All right, so first up we have the Logitech Brio. All right, so now we have the Cisco uh, WebEx desk camera. And so now we have the UVC30 desktop uh, by Yealink. All this stuff is here. Uh, I, I urge you to look into the various software for, for each of these different cameras because they do offer so many settings. And I think we have individual videos showing each camera and all the various uh, settings that are available through the software. Uh, but I talk too much. So anyway, if you like this type of video, don't forget to like, subscribe, comment below, let us know what you'd like to see, and we'll do our best to make it. Thanks.